Hi, DW Berman here. Another little video. This time I was reading in the manual on Saturday, the LightWave 11.5 addendum, that there was a, a change in the way the edges are rendered. Now if I turn VPR on, you'll see, hey, there are my edges. And right now I don't have shrink edges with distance turned on. Guess you can't, but uh, what happens if I move the camera back? Oop, there we go, move it back. Notice the edges aren't getting thinner, they're just getting squished together. And that's been the, the uh, behavior in LightWave for a long time. And there was an interesting thing we could do in LightWave with edges, is if you put them in negative space, like say negative 0.5 or negative 0.2, it would be in uh, pixel space, but now it's actually in meters. So it's actually using real world measurements and not screen space. So what this means is for the first time we can actually make something that is a like a fence or something or net that is a two-point polygon mesh and then set our line thickness into the negative and really that's all it takes to model a complicated piece like this and render it in LightWave because even though it is just two-point polygons I can put geometry on it in a sense and zoom back out and hey look it's shrinking with distance the way we would expect it to work if we had actually modeled this thing out of little tubes connecting all the stuff so this opens up a lot of possibilities or at least a, a limited range of possibilities for uh, doing all kinds of mesh type kind of stuff if you need your mesh connection things to be perfectly round like this is and um, again, this is a two-point polygon thing, so it actually has a surface name. And we can uh, add reflections and whatnot. So if I add a backdrop option, gradient backdrop, and we turn reflection up, we'll see that it actually reflects our background. So, woohoo! Uh, yeah, so subscribe to this channel. If you want to see more tips, tricks, and uh, even sometimes animations, and uh, check out liberty3d.com for my tutorials that I have there. I have a brand new one uh, on doing some s a cartoonish kind of space shot. So uh, check that out. And uh, thanks for watching.